girls and hey little boys so i know i know long time no see but we're back i just had a newborn so <laughs> understand me understand me but i'm not gonna do a long intro you know we're not for these intros just make sure to follow me on instagram and subscribe so guys i have been pumping about 34 ounces a day a day can you believe that can you believe that can you believe that can you believe that and it's crazy because I legit cried in the beginning because I was only pumping like two ounces a day or like one ounce a day. And I finally, finally, finally am pumping a lot. I'm pumping a lot of milk. I'm giving my baby a lot of milk. I'm so grateful for that. But obviously I'm not able to do this alone. I have my little gadgets that have been helping me a lot. Like a lot. Like without these little gadgets, these little tools that I have, I would not be able to pump all of this. Like at all. I'll go crazy. I'll go crazy. So the first thing I recommend you guys to get if you want to pump a lot is these bras. These bras. Oh my God. These bras, I wear them every single day. Every single day. I do not just wear them to pump because some people just like put them up to pump, put them on to pump. I wear them every single day. Legit every every single day. I have them on right now. Because one, they're super comfortable. And two, they're pumping bras, guys. And three, they unclip. So when your baby's crying, he's all fussy. You don't have to take out your bra. You legit just unclip, boop, attach him. When he's done, boop, attach it back. You need these bras. If you're pumping, you need these bras. Because it, ugh, it gets so annoying when you have to hold on to your pump and then hold on to your baby or hold your phone or oh so annoying. With these bras, I legit I legit be forgetting I'm pumping. That's how I be pumping so much because I will legit put these bras on, put my pump, and then just watch a show or just watch my baby. And for like a whole hour. I've pumped for an hour. Like I'm guilty. I've pumped for an hour. And I'll just legit forget I'm pumping because I don't have to do nothing with my hands. I'll even lay back down. I'll do stuff. I'll just do... Ugh, man, these these bras have saved my life. These bras have saved my life. I'm going to show you guys how these bras work because I know I was a little confused when I first got them. So I'm going to show you guys. I'm not going to show you guys me actually pumping because I just finished pumping before making this video. So I'm going to show you guys like on top of my little nipple pad. So basically you just open up right here. It has two little, two little slits. Just open it up. You put your pump right there. Then Easy as that. Like, look at that. And then you just pump. And you legit relax. Relax. You just stay there. Like, what? What? These bras are from Mom Cozy. And, oh, my God. Oh, my God. I'm in love with Mom Cozy. They have breast pumps. They have bras. All types of bras. They have everything. Everything for a mother. So you guys should go to their Instagram. I'm going to leave their Instagram down below too. And check out their website as well. But I'm going to leave the direct link for these bras. Because you guys need these bras. If you're trying to pump a lot. Like I am. So the next thing I recommend you guys to get is a good pump. I'm using. I use the Modelo one. This one. This one I got it free from my through my insurance. Thank God. So you're just going to need a good breast pump. A good electric breast pump. Alright. So now my tips on what I do. I basically start pumping the minute i wake up the minute you wake up that's when you get the most like i've legit gotten 21 ounces from one session in the morning like right when i wake up i get the most on normal day i get like 14 ounces from pumping in the morning the least i'll get in the morning is like 12 ounces but yeah pumping in the morning is so so good like that's where you get the most milk and then after that you pump every two hours but every two hours from when you began so let's say i started pumping at eight in the morning and i finished at 8 30 because i last 30 minutes every time i pump um then i'll pump again at 10 in the morning it is it's stressful like i'm going crazy it's a crazy thing like i'm legit going crazy but i mean i want my baby to have a lot of milk so yeah, and I'm exclusively pumping. That's why I get a lot of milk because I feel like when he's attached to me, he doesn't get a lot of milk, like at all, like at all. So I just switched on to exclusively pumping and I feel like that's what's been working for us because he loves the bottle. So another tip is power pumping. That's what legit increased. That increased my milk supply like crazy. I power pumped for a whole week and a half. And power pumping is basically when you pump for 20 minutes, then you rest. 
and then for 10 minutes, then you pump again for 10 minutes, then you rest for 10 minutes, and then you pump again for 10 minutes, and then you're done. And if you're just doing one boob at a time, but if you have these bras, you're not gonna have to do one boob at a time. You could just pump both. You um for just one boob, you pump for 10 minutes, then rest. Then the next one, pump for 10 minutes, then rest. I'm gonna put a little chart around here so you guys can see because I might forget some of the minutes, but I'm just gonna put one of the charts right there for breast for power pumping. So that's really what helped me. I would even power pump twice a day twice a day because i really wanted my milk supply to increase and actually and it actually worked like it actually worked because i get out so much milk my mom and my sister the jewel would be like what the heck like they've never seen that much milk um try to pump at least six times a day right now i've been pumping um five times a day because i've been having to do a lot of things like going to doctor's appointment and stuff but i usually pump six times a day people usually say to pump six to eight times a day so if you can pump eight times a day do it you'll get way more milk. You'll get way more milk. The next thing I also recommend is um to drink oatmeal every single day. I drink oatmeal every single day. My mom makes me like this oatmeal like smoothie thing and I drink it every single day. Oh, and I also drink Gatorade, blue Gatorade. And guys, this a game changer. I'm pretty sure everybody always says this. Drink a hundred ounces a day, a hundred ounces of water a day. And right there, you'll have milk for days, guys. you have so much milk if you actually drink 100 ounces a day. 100 ounces, no less. 100 ounces a day. I know you could do it. I know you could do it. Just drink it. Chug it. What I do, I fill up my little bottle. That's 34 ounces. I fill it up, and I fill it up. I fill it up, and I chug it sometimes. I legit will just chug it. And then I'll fill it up again, and then I'll just chug it again. And then I'll fill it up again, and then just drink it throughout the whole day. But just drink 100 ounces, and you guys will... You guys will legit go crazy of how much milk is coming out. Because think about it. You're literally taking out liquid from your body. If you don't have liquid inside your body, what, what would you take out? So the more liquid you have inside them in your body, the more liquid is going to come out. So yeah, another thing that I use, I don't know if these really increase my milk supply. But I'm, I, think, I think it did. I'm not sure if it did. But I think it did. Because I was eating them every day and my milk supply... It was crazy. It was crazy. It's the lact lactation cookies. I'm going to put a little picture right here. And I'm going to leave it also in the link below. They're so good. They're so freaking good. Like, I'm craving them right now. They're so good. Oh, my God. They're so good. Another thing also is fish soup. This is a Dominican thing. Everybody in the Dominican Republic always says to drink bacalao soup. Tell somebody to make you bacalao soup. Fish soup, basically. I don't know how to say bacalao in English. I'm going to find the, the word, how you say it in English, and just like, put it here. But bacalao soup, oh my god. Oh my god. Everybody in the Dominican Republic swears by that. Like, everybody in the Dominican Republic swears by that. Even here, Dominicans here, they always say, oh, you got to drink bacalao soup. You got to drink bacalao soup or fish soup to increase your supply. And it works. And it works because look at me. I'm a freaking cow. I am a freaking cow. I am a freaking cow. Um, if you guys want to know how much I pump, how much milk I take out on a, every pump session, I pump about four to seven ounces every single time. Just in the morning, I pump always like 14 ounces, 17 ounces. And then throughout the day, I'll pump sometimes four ounces, sometimes seven ounces, sometimes I pump nine ounces. It just all depends. But... I pump out always a day a day on an average I pump out 33 ounces to sometimes even 40 ounces and that's just in one day guys if you're actually doing this like pumping every two hours oh my god it's so stressful don't feel like you're the only one going crazy I'm going crazy I know people that are going crazy like I legit feel like like I'm going insane I legit feel like I'm going insane I just finished pumping and I already know that I have to pump again and the two hours pass like this like I'll legit look at the time and like what the heck two hours have passed like I I feel like I'm going insane I feel like I'm going insane but I'm doing this for my little baby so it's all worth it but I really legit feel like I'm going insane so if you feel like you're going insane you're not alone you are not alone at all like at all trust me you're not alone so guys that was all i know it's a quick video but i like to keep my videos short and simple i do not like dragging along videos i don't like those videos that they take like 10 minutes to get just to one point and that was all for the video guys if you guys have any questions just 
comment down below. I reply to everybody. Or you could DM me on Instagram. I'm usually more active on Instagram. Oh, and I'm always posting on my Instagram stories like more tips and tricks of me breastfeeding and how I increase my supply. Like any little new thing I find, I always post it on my Instagram story. Always, always, always. So go follow me on there. And you guys can send DMs, DMs through there and I'll always reply. I'll always reply. Any mommy related questions, I always reply to them. So hope you enjoy. Have a good day.